Two at five, prosecutors say the person who shot and killed a woman then left her body in West Knox County, beat her before her death. Those new details emerged this morning in a bond hearing for the key suspect in this case. 10 News reporter Vinay Simlot joins us with more of what we learned in court today. Vinay. John Robin, Jason Young, Tyrone Mack, and Jaquasha Ryans faced bond hearings this morning. Young is the one charged with first degree murder. The other two are charged with helping him after the fact. Today, Judge Tony Stansberry raised Young's bond on the first degree murder charge to $750,000. In arguments before the court, the prosecutor says Alma Matias was shot six times. She says Matias was beaten before her death. That prosecutor says a witness told investigators Jason Young shot and killed Alma Matias. She was stripped naked, she was wrapped in a trash bag, drove to a remote area in West Hospital, dumped uh, near a hiking and running trail, naked, wrapped in a blanket and a trash bag. The Knox County Sheriff's Office found Matias's body on North Shore Drive near the Concord Greenway on July 30th. Friends of Alma Matias say she was friends with Young, Mac, and Ryan, so three people charged in connection with her death. We had a witness who identified Mr. Young as the person inside the apartment who committed the murder of Alma Matias. The prosecutor told the court Young then burnt Matias's car to a crisp. Authorities allege a fourth person, Rontrell Allen, helped him burn the car. All three of these people charged, Jason Young, Tyrone Mack, and Jaquasha Ryans, will appear in court again on October 24th for a preliminary hearing. There, a judge will decide if there is enough evidence to send the case to a grand jury. Rontrell Allen is set for a bond hearing on, on August 23rd, later this month, on that arson charge. Quickly, Vinay, we also got answers to our questions about the timing of the accused murderer's arrest. Yeah, he turned himself in on arson and theft charges on July 31st, and then he was charged with first degree murder on the 5th. He was able to bond out before the sheriff's office got an arrest warrant for the murder. The sheriff's office, we learned today, gathered more evidence and got a witness inside the apartment who says Jason Young shot Alma Matias in between this time frame right here, John and Robin. And he did turn himself in, Vinay. Yes. Yes, we appreciate the update. Thanks very much.